So it's Friday night and I had a whole day of shit that I didn't record because I had to fucking charge the camera. But now we're Friday night, almost 11 p.m. I'm going to hitch the camper onto the truck. Why? We're going to get new safety chains, bud. Fuck. Yes! All right, we're on. Time to go to the fucking shop. Hey? Hey? It's late. I'm getting tired. Let's go. I got some nice pieces of angle iron here. Yeah? Nice angle iron. This is a restricted area. You need to get that camera off immediately. Hey, what are you doing with this car, bud? What? No, I'm good. It's a fucking Shelby. Is this the one you went and picked up? Yeah, I'm taking parts off it. I already got the engine and transmission that are really good. I got the A555 with a 385 ratio. Really good for, uh, you know, aggressive launches and whatnot. I'm taking the parts I need off this. I'm taking it into the fucking boneyard tomorrow. What's going on over here? It's too bad that fucking door was open or no one would have came in here. You're, putting, you're getting a new collar pin. Over there, rags. Give me a couple of rags. Is this okay? Yeah, whatever. Not a rag. We're on the floor. On the floor. On the floor. <laughs> so this one has the hammer locked on it. Give us a good idea what the rest of them look like at the same time. Having no flashlight, I'm not doing anything too good right now. But I'm just I got a check. flashlight on my phone. I'm gonna check for continuity in here, okay? You want me to do the thing? Well, you got some morettes for like a house here and some scotch locks. I think I found the problem already. That is <laughs> not what you're supposed to do. Shit, homie. Yeah, there's a scotch locks. Yeah, you're supposed to use like a, a shrink tube connector. I see. So this is the junk that was fucking holding the brake wires together on the back of the trailer. So, good to be rid of that. Why are you always fucking filming stuff? Because they gotta make movies for the internet, bud. Yeah, but why? Um, well, I wanna fucking entertain people. I think people would like seeing a fucking chain get welded to a fucking trailer. Well, why don't you fucking help me instead of doing something wrong? Yeah, what kind of help do you need? Is there a hammer somewhere? Uh, is it on this side? Maybe. I think it's on that side. Got that block of wood. Here's the block. You want me to look for a hammer? This is what you're using? Can happen, but
just left it. Hey, why don't you just lift it up in the center and drive it out? I'd rather back up because there's no one steering the motherfucker from around here. That's what I'm saying. If you just lift it up with a forklift. Get in, get in the building. But you just I like it in the building. But you just lift it with a forklift pipe. Get in the building. I'm just saying, lift it with the forklift. Hey, look at these fucking cool things that Dan get found in that fucking shadow. Snake fucking head. Tire valve covers. So I'm gonna fucking put them on the camper! <laughs> All right, so friggin' basically, it's almost three o'clock in the morning, Saturday morning, and uh, what Dan determined is that the brake lines, the electrical for the brakes are fucked on the camper big time. And uh, that means that we gotta get uh, some work done to it. So I think he's gonna try to find some time between now and the gathering to get my brakes fixed, so I'm gung-ho to go ahead and buy a brake controller uh, for it. So I'm gonna load this fucking shadow onto the fucking trailer and call it a fucking night. I am so tired. Let's go into Saturday day right now. Every time I wanna fucking work on the camper, ooh, it's dry right here. Every time I want to work on the camper, I can't work on the camper because it's raining. And that shit pisses me off, man. The gathering is fucking coming, and I just want to get the cowls onto the fucking roof, man. <laughs> the Iceman's coming. It was so fun pulling this yesterday. Dude, I suck at backing shit up, hey? Eh? I suck at backing shit up, and, ooh, I shouldn't walk through here to make the movie. Anyway, I suck at backing shit up, and check it out. I fucking did a pretty damn good job backing the camper in by myself last night. Didn't fucking hit the house at all, and that's about as close as you can freaking get it. Like, really good. And I went and got the go-karts yesterday, so maybe we can have a little fucking fun with those. But I think it's probably a smart idea to get out of the rain. Oh, let's go in the camper. Dude, the fucking camper, bod. Fuck. I just, I love the fucking camper. So these are the fucking cowls for the roof vents. I've been only waiting like a fucking year to get them on. Last year when Iceman did all the work. But last year when we put the fucking ceiling panels in, the new ceiling panels, it was... Oh, fuck, man. Less than 24 hours or less than 36 hours before I had to hitch on and leave for the gathering. And I'm like, I don't, I don't even care, bro. I don't care. I'll fucking put plastic on the fucking roof and we'll pull it like that. Because I, I was not spending two grand to have a camper and not fucking be able to pull it to the gathering. So, like, yeah, man. Less than a day. Less than a fucking day, and the Iceman comes, and he was so pissed, like, he was, he was mad, because he had been doing everything, the Iceman does a lot of shit for me, you guys, like, a lot of fucking shit, and he was mad last year, because he, he scraped off, like, 80% of the fucking, I can't wait to get up on the roof and show you, but he scraped off like 80% of all the sealant on the roof. I hardly did the other 20% as good as he did the 80%. And then he took the fucking shit and, and laid down all the new seal for me because he knows that I suck shit. And if it wasn't for the Iceman's old fucking crippled arthritic hands, <sighs> there's a lot of shit here that I wouldn't have. When I first lived in the fucking park... Uh, I got some, the guy that I bought the house from put in a new window, put in a couple new windows, and when he sealed them, there was a hole in the fucking caulking, and, uh, the water shed down, like, if this is the window, okay, the water 
entered at the top of the window and shed down on each side of the window, cascading out. And like from the top of the window all the way, I'm gonna go and show you, fuck it. But the water was cascading down uh, the fucking wall. And anyway, so I woke up one morning and I'm like, oh, there's some water on the, uh, on the uh, floor. I don't remember spilling anything. So I grabbed a towel and I put the towel down on the floor to absorb some of the moisture. And what the fuck happened? My foot went right through the fucking floor, bud. It was fucked. I was so pissed. So look, so the ice man came and he fixed it all. Anyway, what I'm getting at is this. So this is the window that flooded. And from the top of the window all the way down to the edge of the fucking... Here, all the way down to the edge. Black. It was fucking black. The whole thing. It was, touch it with your finger and you're, and you're poking right through it, bud. When we dug out the bad insulation, then we saw the black plywood, and the plywood, that's the fucking house. So when we pulled the plywood out, we were staring right at this uh, vinyl. So, like, holy shit. The Iceman replaced half of, like, a quarter of a room. Like, from here to here, he rebuilt the entire structure because it, it all needed to be replaced. We put in a new window. And, uh, and same over here, when we first got the place, you can see how Iceman, how he's gone through and fucking sealed it all. But, uh, somewhere here, somewhere along right here, I think this little dark line right here is actually the friggin' spot. When the, when the other guy installed the fucking windows, he left a gap here. And all this fucking rainwater flooded all down inside of here. And it was the same fucking thing. So basically, this part of the wall never got replaced. But all this drywall had to be replaced and insulation had to be replaced. It was a bunch of black fucking mold. And the Iceman changed this whole wall here. So, you know, without the fucking Iceman, a lot of my shit would be super fucked. A piece of the floor in the house still needs to be replaced from that. A whole 4x8, excuse me, a whole 4x8 sheet of plywood needs to be fucking replaced. So that's fucked. But, uh, whatever, whatever, dog. I just don't walk on that pot. I put a big table in the back and shit. Anyway, the Weather Network said that, uh, this is supposed to be like, uh, isolated rain hopefully it's gonna fucking stop raining uh in the next hour or so and even if it's wet i'll just get some towels and dry the roof because i'm putting those motherfucking cowls on man I just want to get the camper going oh let's look at the safety chains hey dan did a good job welding them on i think Oh yeah, those aren't fucking going anywhere, bud. I heard somebody. I'm freaking out. <laughs> anyway, there's water all over the lens and I've been rambling on for five minutes, but uh, the bottom line is, without the ice, man, <laughs> I would be fucked. And I don't do anything for him. He does everything for me. I don't know. Uh, maybe I help him feel youthful making the movies, but I don't know. That is a pretty big job to make the ice man feel young. <laughs> anyway, whatever. Hey, bud. I don't think that uh, cameras and water, I don't think your camera and water mix very good. Probably not. What's up? Not too much, buddy. It's fucking raining outside. I can't believe this. I thought it was going to be nice today. The weather thing said that it should clear up by noon, hopefully. I got it looks like pretty clear, even though it's like completely overcast. Yeah. The blue is shining through the clouds. Look at that. I don't know if it's going to do what we want. Oh, shit. Let's go fucking do it right now. Gizmo, come. I talked about you, bud, for all the movies. Come on, let's go. You did? What are you saying about me? Just saying that without you, I would have nothing. Ouch. That without your fucking old crippled hands. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Thanks. <laughs> I showed them how you replaced half a wall in my house, a whole wall in my house. Yeah. A one and a half wall. One and a half. And a window. Yeah. 
so much bullshit. So is this where you were laying with your uh, Snapchat? Yeah, right back here, bud! Yeah! That was so much awesome! I can't fucking wait for the gathering, bud. Yeah? <laughs> Look at oh, you getting yeah. all sexy, eh? I'm fucking ready to gather. That's awesome. Anyway, let's Anyways, yeah, let's take a look here. Something. Nice. So last year, <coughs> when we pulled all the fiberboard, I'm sure I've said it a million times, but last year we pulled all the fiberboard out of the fucking ceiling here. And the ice man. That's what I was saying. A day, a day before the gathering, you came and put in the ceiling. One day, we got it friggin' done. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> but I had the panels for like two months. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, when we ripped all the fiberboard out of the ceiling, a bunch of it went into the tub. And I think, whoa, and I think that uh, that swelled up in the fucking drain and made the tub not drain properly. So hopefully this little short snake. Hopefully that's long enough. That is pretty short, isn't it? It is a camper though. Yeah. Hopefully this snake is gonna fucking clear out any problem that we have in here. Let's go take a look. We're not plugged in. can't go in anymore. Don't go any farther. How far is it? Let me see. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, this thing's probably going to come up with like all a bunch of black gunk <laughs> shit onto it. Well, it's passing pr pretty freely in there. Seems Hopefully whatever now. was in there maybe dried and we pushed it through already. That's what it seems like. Yeah, maybe it's in the tank now. Oh, it stinks like shit. Does it? Oh. I don't even want to. <laughs> it stinks like shit in here, man. Damn. Yeah, I think we fucking unplugged something, didn't we? Can you smell it? Yeah. Oh, oh my god, dude. Ugh. This thing is stuck in here. This week's challenge, who can stay in this bathroom the oh, longest? Fuck, uh, okay, is there anything, uh, like a, a piece of plastic or something in the sink that I can use as a little glove to pinch grip? That tape shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes! <laughs> okay, fucking... Ugh. I thought that we had uh, it flushed. Oh, fuck, that stinks. Oh, it splashed me in the face! It splashed me in the face! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it splashed me all over my fucking face! It went in my mouth, man! Oh my god, dude! What's he wanting? I got right? a shit face! Okay, enough. Iceman. I'm fucking shit <laughs> You're shit bud. today, buddy. <laughs> no alcohol involved. Dude. I don't know if that oh fucking... Oh my god. Are you, you just out of here? <laughs> I don't want to touch it now. <laughs> well, it doesn't look that bad. Yeah, but it shit faced me, bud. My face reeks like shit right now. Come on, come on. Come on. This way. That was the fucking worst. Thanks, Iceman. <laughs> <laughs> Always glad to fucking help. I gotta wash my hands and face yeah, right no now. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> Look at this. What do we got here? Yeah, I told you. The movies are changing my life, bud. I went and saw my doctor. And he get her done. He scheduled me to go get an EKG. Chest pain. Yeah. Hey. Well, I'm honestly only guessing that I'm putting the bolt in the right way. Um, I mean, I'd prefer to have it in the metal, but it would look kind of stupid if the bolt was sticking up, right? You'd want the head you at the top. match yourself back. Nice. You want this at the top instead of the bolt sticking out at the top, right? Yeah, yeah I think so. What, yeah, I understand. The my, my, only, my only concern is that it's in plastic rather than in the metal. 
But uh, I guess that's yeah, the way it is. Yeah, tray on play that for next year. Doesn't, uh, doesn't the uh, diagram show which way the head should face? There's one on the ground there. Aha! I didn't see that. Uh, bolt up, yeah. So I'm doing it backwards. I guess I gotta change it around. Not up, you mean? I just feel silly having the bolt at the top, but that's the right way, so we'll yeah. change it. That's what the French, French people say. Oh, English on the other side too. It's <laughs> unanimous. <laughs> so Iceman, hey. it's been about a year since you've been up here. Yeah, it's been about that, eh? How are these seals looking, bud? They still look good. Are they lifting a little bit or is that old tar? Where are you at? Oh, look at that. That does look like it's lifting a little over there, doesn't it? Uh -huh. It's okay. Uh, that's the only one that looks like it's really lifting. I see, I see a little in the back here too. Oh, a little bit right along here too, I guess. Oh. How is it hard? I can't tell. I'm not over there. Oh. <laughs> this has still got some pliability to it here. Well, it sat out here uncovered all winter. And a huge drift of snow built up right here and fucking sat pretty much all winter. And that bummed me out. Look at this fucking roof. The guy came, he silver coated it, and then he put this ice and water shit onto it and then sealed it with a silicone. And then he never put the silver onto this. And this sits parallel with the roof. So all the water doesn't fucking flow down. It all sits in here and rots. I paid this guy like three grand to come and fix all this. Ooh, it's better. Oh, shit. Oh, it's soft here, bud. Did you hear that cracking? I did, yeah. Where at? Bud, like right fucking here. Holy shit. Dude, anyway, and I'm telling the story, man. <laughs> I paid this fucking guy. And it's pretty much the same area. <laughs> yeah. I pay this fucking guy like three grand a couple years ago to come and fix all this. There was some leaking. He fixed it and then it was still leaking and then worse in other spots that previously didn't leak. And now, the, dude, I want to rip this thing down so bad, but I like the only thing that I like about it is that it protects these living room windows from sunlight. Uh, and that's it. If I tore this fucking thing down, I could back the camper up farther into the yard. That would be pretty sweet. But I still want a cover for the camper, though. Like, this lean-to is too short for the camper. But I would love to... I would fucking put, like, an extension on the roof and some, like, aluminum poles with a tarp or something. Like, not super ghetto, not oh, super ghetto. <laughs> Something, like, appropriate. How's that shit looking over there? Lifted? Yeah, it's definitely lifted. Problematic? Uh, well, we're not seeing any water, so... All right, we got one open. Is that hey. all the way? Is that as far as it goes? Yeah. All right. That's okay. I just, if it did go farther, I'd do it. All right, oh, all three of them. I didn't even know to show up in the other two already. <laughs> That's awesome. You've been waiting for me? Yeah, I've just been while I was looking at the dog. Of oh, course. For fuck's sake. What else would I be doing, right? <laughs> Ice, what are you thinking? I'm thinking this is going pretty good. Yeah? I think so. Seems pretty straightforward with a lot of crazy measurements, eh? Like a lot of uh, variables to put it in the right way. <clears throat> now this is where I gotta make sure I get her pretty well straight. Do we peel the little stupid stickers off? The price sticker on the back or no? Um, yeah, I guess we should, shouldn't we? That looks kind of dumb. Iceman drilled the holes and now he's about to put the fucking brackets on. That's not a bad deal. $43.95 down to $26.95. Yeah, I got them for under a hundred bucks. Okay, we need this, this, this. 
this. Careful. If there was a hole there, any size hole, it would have went down. <laughs> What happened in there, puppy? He's in the camper he's looking for you? Camper, yep. He's Holy looking up shit. at me. I can't see him, but I know he's right under there looking up at me. Well, I think if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right, Ice? Once you get these cowls on these things, that peeling shit probably isn't going to be too much of a problem. Well, wait and see how it does. I mean, we haven't seen any damage. You'd see it those panels in no time. Oh, Especially yeah. Especially with the rains we've had. Uh-huh. And so snow think, sat here all winter. Yeah, so I think you're pretty safe for now anyways. Let's let the summer go and see how it goes. We'll cover it up next winter for sure. Should we cut the peeling part off? I'm afraid if you start cutting anything away, it'll just make it worse. That's what I think, too. So, uh, we got one on here. I've got two more to do, but this one's all attached. Got one over there. That one up there. And we got this guy over here. A lot of help, isn't he? Look at that, I'm with stupid. What? Uh <laughs> anyways, back to work. Get these two put on. We're almost done. Alright, that's number two up. Now we just gotta get this third one. Let's uh we got here we got the brackets all on it's all closed up so I can fit this piece of shit on so I guess that's what it looks like with the vent open I bet it only opens maybe like 30% uh, or fucking 40% of what it used to open fully before the cowl was put on but it still lets in air I can feel it and it, you can have them open when there's fucking rain that's the best part, man. And you can have them open while you're driving. <coughs> Excuse me. You can have them open when you're driving so that fresh air can pump in. Holy shit, I'm so fucking happy. Like I said, man, I don't know where I would be without the ice, man. Hey. Okay. So we're gonna leave them fucking open. I think it's maybe gonna rain again. Ice! Hey. What are you doing, bud? I thought you were talking to somebody. Here. Talking to the people. Talking to the people. Um, yeah, so I'm thinking if you want to do Chinese, I'm only going to eat the amount of a combination platter. So I'll just get that. That's like fucking 10 bucks. Do you want Chinese food? I wouldn't mind Chinese food. I like Chinese food. Maybe I should go drive some fucking Chinese into me, bud. I think you should. It's good for you. All right, let's No MSG. Do oh, I'm out. <laughs> Deal breaker. Well, I felt like doing dabs in the camper. Careful, bud. Oh, yeah. Uh, I felt like doing dabs in the camper, but it's really hot in there, so we got to plug it in and get this AC on, right? Yeah. Fucking spider webs. Oh, I hate that kind. <laughs> Me too. Okay, last one. Yeah, we got to get this cover off too, don't we? Yeah, the first time I plugged it in, I turned the air on. It was on for almost 45 minutes before I realized the cover was on it. I'm like... Why is it not getting cold in here? And you're like, and you're like, I don't know. <laughs> and then I'm like, never again, never again. And then I went to the gathering. <coughs> and sure enough, I fucking turned it on for like 20 minutes. Of course, when you get there and get set up, it's hot right away. So you just want to cool off. This is uh, got to be moisture from sitting inside the bag. That or rain. Rainwater sitting yeah. inside the bag. Yeah. We'll have to fucking put a slit in the bag yeah, to let it drain. I'm All right, well, are we plugged that. in? We're plugged I think in. we're ready to fucking we turn some power, power on, on, bud. That's Let's the first it. time for the season. I'm excited. So we got the air conditioning running. Oh, here he comes. Get that damn door closed. Get this cool air going. I can feel it, eh? Feels fucking nice coming from oh, back fuck. there. Oh, fuck. I love I love it. This is awesome. Oh, yeah, bud. I feel it. It's on cool high. Yeah? Ugh. Oh, I have. Look at that fucking mattress you got back there. Eh? That ain't no camper mattress. I know, eh? <laughs> the breaker was off. 
Was it really? Yeah, I had to oh, lift shit. the bed and get the breaker back on and shit. Well, that sucks. Fucking nice green and blue curtains. Yeah, custom. They, they go nice with the balance. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of lights that don't work because we had to pull old bulbs to put in. Yeah, like no bulb. This one works, doesn't it? This one works, yeah. yeah. You wired this one like a mother There it is. Whoa, that's bright shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This light never goes on. <laughs> it's Sunday right now, and uh, I slept in the fucking camper last night. It was awesome. I had some company come over and hang out. I hung out inside the camper and I sat at that table and now my back is just fucked, but oh, it was so worth it, man. I get to sleep in the bed. Check it out. <laughs> I don't know if you guys think this is dumb or not, but I fucking love it. Look, I fucking slept in here. It was great. Oh, yeah, put this t-shirt on right now. So anyway, uh, now it's Sunday, like I said. I'm going to pull the camper over to my mom's place because I don't have external, uh, excuse me, water on the house. So, I'm going to go to my mom's place, wash the camper today. But more importantly, I'm going to flush the antifreeze out of the lines and test the water lines, I guess. <laughs> Let's fucking go! Alright, so I hooked the city water line up to this line, to this line outside. I open the fucking tap so that the water will come in and go down into the lines. I create back pressure for the offline water system by closing this tap and then the pump will suck water from the tank here okay, and it'll push it through the pump down into the floor to the uh, to the rest of the line. So right now I got city water out external water running in it's flooding the lines. I got the cold water tap open I put the uh, hot water stopper back inside the uh, inside the tank here, wherever the fuck it is. That rusty circle there. Hey, the rusty circle, bud. The rusty circle, yeah. <laughs> Plugging it with my finger. And uh, and then I've got the uh, the bathroom sink open, and I'm not sure about after getting shit faced if I should if I should run water in this unattended. So I am going to prep a couple other things. We're going to let this water run, and hopefully it's bleeding out the lines of the antifreeze. And I'll run over here and show you. <coughs> I just got my... The water's actually running already pretty fucking clear out of here. It's purging out a little bit of shit water. But uh, we're going to get this cleared out, and then I'm going to do the same thing with the toilets. And I'm just going to keep letting the uh, water run out of the drain into the into the sewer open sewer i don't think that what i'm doing is uh, illegal if i am i don't really give a shit so it's already going to be said and done by the time it's done but that's what's up with that so what do you think i think it's doing a pretty good job well, probably should go for broke and just fucking see what the bathtub does if not if, you it, starts... if it if it doesn't drain you have to clean it out okay. all right go ahead turn it on bud Take it off the knob. What knob? Uh, take the shower head off of the... Yeah. But don't get all that... All that debris is gonna fucking... We can create more pressure in the shower by turning the other taps off. So it's been a couple of minutes and uh, we've just been running the fucking shower non-stop and it seems that uh, this tub is fucking draining, isn't it, bud? Tub's draining. Oh, you left. So the water's running pretty clear out here. I'm gonna turn these taps all on now for a couple minutes and really let them get the fucking juice out. It smells like asshole, bud. Oh, I bet. Is it running kind of clear though? Yeah, it's running clear. I asked Lunchbox to check the shit water. He said it fucking reeks. Well, it doesn't smell that bad, but it's definitely not running clear, is it? So I think instead of holding the fucking... <coughs> Excuse me again. I think instead of holding the, uh, the, the tap open for the toilet, I think I'm just going to fucking put the hose directly into the toilet. And, uh... Fucking mosquitoes. 
put the hose directly in the toilet and let it simmer. It's starting to run a little clearer though already, isn't it? I'm still gonna run the hose into it and see what happens. So yeah, bud, we flushed the fucking water lines. All the antifreeze and that shit and think is fucking looking Look, pretty good. You. Come on, come on. Yeah, I know. Well, you weren't fucking moving and the dog is retarded. Yeah. So we fucking, I snaked, I got shit faced. Yeah. And then we ran, so look, bud, it's clean. We ran water through it. We ran water through it for like five minutes out of the shower head and it didn't fucking. It didn't come up at all? No, awesome. not at all. Rinsed it out. I fucking put the hose right inside the camper and ran the water down the toilet for maybe like five minutes. The water was running pretty chocolate when we started and pretty clear when we finished. Yeah. But especially the gray water lines ran super clear. That's good, right on. So I think what's next is... Uh, Why is that out? Uh, I don't know. Maybe I was looking for the hot water tank or something in the wintertime. So I think what's next is uh, just fucking wash the outside, bud. That's what it looks like. So that's what we're going to get down to right now. Well, here it is. The first fucking damage I've done to the truck. Very, very insignificant, but I put the fucking oh, hose right. tap here and then I dropped the fucking gate and for like 10 and I jumped up onto it and shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm stupid. Not too bad. Fuck sakes. Asian. Mom. Blake. Where are you going? Uh, we're going to Kingsville. Me and Holly. Hoop. I thought you were going to the casino to get drunk and fuck dudes. Nice. Sounds like a nice time, doesn't it? No, because I hate men. But anyway... Um, Are you going to the casino to gamble some money? No, we're not going to the casino now because everybody screwed up my day. So, I we don't have time now to go to the casino. Mom, so what are you going, going to Kingsville, Kingsville for? Ice cream? Yeah. And hang out at the water? Yeah. Do something more fun than that. Go to the casino and fuck some guys. Don't be so rude, Blake. You're talking to your mom. You know. Like, I just want you to be happy, Mom. I thought you liked getting laid. Nice. No, I don't like men because every man. Well, meet some women, Mom. Go to the strip oh, club. Oh, could I? You're jacking. Hey, you and my mom are going to the strip club to meet some women. Yep. Happy Father's Day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? I'm drinking this water. I got the fucking truck clean. I got the trailer clean. Yeah, look clean. at that, eh? It's fucking Lunchbox shining Lunchbox did most nice of the sense. scrubbing, even though I kept interjecting to do it. He did, but I did notice that while he did most of the scrubbing, he went over and scrubbed his car by himself. And you know, I, I even helped with the fucking trailer, bud. <laughs> yeah, I know. You, and, then, and then you did your car by yourself. <laughs> Whatever, oh, my well. car looks well, look good. Look at that. Yeah, they're both shiny. We got the fucking trailer shiny and the car over there. My van, I decided I'm just going to leave it. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. I don't give a shit. Got your cooler it's back my day, away, so bud. I don't, yeah, well, you're going to take that now, I guess. Take yeah, I'll take it off your hands tonight. for you. I'll it back for a few minutes. Got to take the kids to soccer practice tonight? No, not tonight, buddy. <laughs> no. Nope. Sundays are my day off. And it's Father's Day. Oh, yeah. Happy Father's Day, Ice Man. Yeah, yeah, happy Father's, Father's Day, day bud. Lunchbox. Yeah, happy Father's Day. I don't really uh, celebrate them too much. I do it for my kid, honestly. I really don't. Yeah, care. whatever. And you, yours is so little. It doesn't like the kid doesn't even know you. My wife does shit for me. Yeah, yeah, that's what matters, right? Yeah, yeah. The yeah. wife does the shit for you. Yeah. I don't got a wife anymore, so. Yeah, it's just him and the dog. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me, the dog, and the kid. Dog do nothing, eh? Yep, the way it should Shit's be. Shit's on your floor, maybe. <laughs> no, not even. He's a good guy, aren't you? Pukes once in a while. <laughs> well, Ice Man, I think that maybe what we should do is shut this shit show down and fucking go Damn eat some cramp. fucking food. Yeah, I think so too. Make we got movie. another movie to make. Sounds good. Yep. The Let's do the it. Fire. Trying to make a movie here today. Everything's going fucking all haywire. I need the keys. The dogs are fucking being idiots, of course. Hey. The camper looks clean from here. It does. Hey. Look at those fucking roof vents too, bud. You did I know, that. those are awesome, eh? Look at that up there. Your uh, your dad today, he looks up, he's like, where did he get the antenna? Did he steal it from somebody? My dad's a fucking... <laughs> what? My dad's just an old... Dude. Yeah, he is. Look at this guy hey, over here on his fucking, fucking bike. Don't fucking... Listen, oh. hey, man. Don't fucking videotape me backing in and fucking up <laughs> and like... I don't have any mirrors on the truck right now, and he's Oh, here we go. We're starting in. with the excuse. He's got you in. I'll put the in. fucking mirrors on right now. Here are I your backed mirrors. in already without anybody's your help. I see a your mirrors. mirrors on the truck. I don't know. I'll right put there. Them on. That's your mirrors right there. He's walking away. 
Hey, look. You're going to stop that. Look, I told you to be nice to Beef. Beef, hey, Beef, get over here. Beef. Beef. Oh my God, Box, come on. You're polluting the neighborhood, buddy. Beef, come. Over here, now. There we go, he's starting. He's already starting it off. Let's get a little bit closer. Let's watch what he does over here. Hey, I want you to stay. Okay, I want you to stay there. Where's he going? I don't know. Looks like he's trying to back it into the uh, trailer across the way there. <laughs> you live back here. <laughs> no, not even close. <laughs> you live, you live over here, buddy. Look at that. Hey doggies. Beef, get over here. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. In the back. Come on. That's better. Damn mosquitoes, I'm gonna fucking have West Nile by the end of the day. <laughs> now we got somebody who wants to uh <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what he's doing here. I mean he's done this before. I've seen him do it. I helped him once. I guess maybe he should put the damn oh, meters on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Straighten out. Oh, look at that. Starting again. Gizmo. Okay. Why you gotta be like that? Stop barking in his face. Oh, Beef. Way, you bark back in his face. You tell him. Hey, Gizmo, don't you dare. No. See, it's that easy, Beef. Just tell him. You're a jerk. <laughs> Look at this guy here, eh? Hey, you do it. Did you record this? I am. Ah. Yeah, you. you stay. No, beef. Get back. You get back. Move. Move. Now he's getting fed up. <laughs> Just throw up the neighbor's grass. Keep going, you're good. Keep it turning. You're good, bud. Keep going. How, how's this corner up there? He's all right. Oh, here we go. Somebody else. <laughs> That's funny. I love it. <laughs> he's going to be so pissed at me when he's watching this footage. This is fucking worth it. <laughs> oh fuck, maybe I shouldn't have my van there. Got this. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Boy fix. Now we're getting somewhere. Almost like he knew what he was doing. <laughs> From this very moment, it's almost like he knew what he was doing. Starting now. Yes. <laughs> Beef, hey! Beef! Stop! 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 Beef, you're going inside. Let's go. Come on, inside now. Let's go. Inside, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
Shame you, huh? Stupid. Get in there. Okay! You stay here. Look it. In the grass. Get over there. Get over there. Stay. Stay. Who's your daddy? You stay there. How close it gets to the freaking pavement there. We're almost there. You got you still got five feet. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Let me see. Uh, I think you're got a little less space this time because you're this way more. Go back a little bit. Just just a bit, just a bit, just a bit, just a bit. Keep coming. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Stop, stop. Right there. That's it. We're in. Let's go get beef. Hey, dumb. You can come out now. Come on, beef. Gizmo, nice. Hey. Stop. Don't be a jackass. Gizmo. Stop. How was that? You're in, buddy. <laughs> Wasn't too bad with no mirrors. Yep. No, that was pretty good. I mean, well, from from the from the starting point that we deemed as being the new starting point. <laughs> we did that three then times. Then it was though. okay. <laughs> what was the new starting point when the back axles hit the fucking sidewalk? No. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. No, the new starting point we gave you from the driveway. <laughs> when you were going straight. Yep. <laughs> Hey man, I did it you did by good. myself at three o'clock in the morning the other day. Yeah, I don't know how you did that. We well, had the mirrors, but still, I, I still, got don't, out know. A couple I still times. don't know how you did it. Were you drunk? Too, but hey, or? we're in. Look at this. Oh, yeah. That's it. <laughs>